An Iranian scientist says that he's created a time machine. Jag har gjort att jobba på Öland. Och kom hem då och gick in i köket. Nej vad fan. Så det var precis som att massa vatten på golvet där då. Time travel captivates our imagination, bridging the gap between reality and the fantastical. Its portrayal in popular culture through films, books, and TV shows often explores the consequences of moving through time, from altering historical events to experiencing future possibilities. So let's start the video. The Moberly Jordan Incident, 1901. In 1901, two British academics, Charlotte Ann Moberly and Eleanor Jourdain, experienced what they believed was a time slip while visiting the Palace of Versailles. They claimed to have encountered figures from the late 18th century, including one who resembled Marie Antoinette. This incident sparked much debate and skepticism as the women described seeing buildings and scenes that seemingly no longer existed. Their story, detailed in their book, An Adventure, remains one of the most famous and controversial anecdotes in time travel lore. The Vanishing, 1940 car, 1969. This peculiar tale emerged from Louisiana in 1969, when two men driving along a highway reportedly saw a car bearing a 1940 license plate. As they approached, the car's style matched the era of the plate, and it contained occupants dressed in period clothing. Intrigued, they attempted to get a closer look, but as they did, the vehicle inexplicably vanished from sight, leaving no trace. This story has been repeated in various forms, often used to argue the possibility of temporal anomalies or slips through time. The Torad Man, 1954. In one of the most baffling tales of supposed time travel, a man arrived at Tokyo's Haneda Airport in 1954, presenting a passport from Torad, a country that doesn't exist. His documents appeared legitimate, featuring visas from previous trips, yet no country named Tored was recognized globally. Authorities were perplexed when he described Tored as located between France and Spain, a region known only for the small nation of Andorra. Detained overnight for further investigation, he inexplicably disappeared from a high security room, leaving no trace behind and no answers to the mystery of his origin. Rudolf Fence, 1951. The strange case of Rudolf Fence is an urban legend often cited as a real-life time travel incident. According to the story, a man wearing 19th century clothing appeared in Times Square in 1951, seemingly confused by his surroundings. He was struck by a car and found to possess items from the 1870s, including currency and business cards, none of which showed signs of aging. Investigations supposedly traced him back to the 1870s, where he had vanished without a trace, leading to speculation that he had unwittingly traveled through time to the future. Andrew Carlson, 2003. In 2003, Andrew Carlson made headlines when he was arrested by the SEC for securities fraud after turning a modest investment of $800 into over $350 million in just two weeks. During his interrogation, Carlson claimed to be a time traveler from 200 years in the future, possessing advanced knowledge of the stock market. He offered to provide information on future technologies and historical events in exchange for leniency and the chance to return to his time. The bizarre story ended as suddenly as it began when a mysterious figure posted his bail and Carlson disappeared, sparking rumors and conspiracy theories about his true identity and the veracity of his claims. The Iranian Time Machine, 2013. In 2013, an Iranian scientist named Ali Rezeghi claimed to have invented a device that could predict the future of individuals up to five years in advance. The machine, according to Rezeghi, fit into the size of a personal computer case and worked by using a complex set of algorithms to predict the future. Despite widespread media attention, skeptics quickly dismissed the claims as fantastical and no demonstrable evidence was ever presented to verify the functionality of the device. The story, though intriguing, left many more questions than answers about the possibilities of predicting future events through technology. Robert Todino, 2003. Robert Todino, from Massachusetts, became known in 2003 for his persistent efforts to obtain parts to build a time machine. His numerous emails requesting obscure and fictional components, like a transducing capacitor, were widely circulated online, becoming a peculiar example of internet folklore. 
Todino claimed he needed the time machine to travel back and prevent personal misfortunes and hardships. Despite the seemingly humorous nature of his quest, it was later revealed that Todino genuinely believed in his mission, underscoring a tragic aspect to his story intertwined with mental health issues. The Time Traveling Hipster, 1941. This story revolves around a photograph from the 1940 reopening of the South Fork Bridge in British Columbia, Canada. The photo gained internet fame as it appeared to show a man dressed incongruously for the time, wearing what seemed to be modern sunglasses and clothing. Dubbed the Time Traveling Hipster, the image became a centerpiece in discussions about time travel evidence. However, further analysis suggested that all elements of his attire were available at the time, although not common, leading many to conclude that the image was simply a case of unusual fashion rather than proof of time travel. Haka Nordkvist, 2006. In 2006, Hakan Nordfist claimed an extraordinary event. He purportedly traveled forward in time and met his future self. Nordfist reported that during a simple attempt to fix a leak under his sink, he crawled through a passage that led him into the future to the year 2042. There, he encountered an older version of himself, and the two conversed and compared tattoos as proof of their identity. He even filmed the encounter on his mobile phone providing what he claimed was tangible evidence of this meeting. Skeptics, however, have dismissed the video as a clever hoax, likely staged as part of an advertising campaign by a pension company known for using elaborate marketing strategies. The Time Slip Hotel, 1970s. The mystery of the Time Slip Hotel centers around a peculiar experience reported by two couples traveling in Spain during the 1970s. They checked into an old-fashioned hotel that seemed oddly out of place, as if from a bygone era. The staff wore outdated uniforms, and the hotel lacked modern amenities such as telephones. The next morning, the hotel had seemingly vanished without a trace, leaving only an empty field. Further investigations revealed no record of the hotel ever existing. This story has been cited as a possible example of a time slip, an event where individuals reportedly pass briefly into another time period. We've journeyed through some of the most intriguing and debated time travel stories, from the historical figures of Versailles and the Moberly Jourdain incident to the enigmatic vanishing of the time slip hotel. Each story, wrapped in mystery and skepticism, challenges our perceptions of reality and time. If you enjoyed these mysterious glimpses into the potential ripples in our timeline, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more content exploring the unexplained and the unknown. Share your thoughts and theories below, and join us as we uncover more of the world's most perplexing phenomena.